We are almost underway. Round one. Let's see what they try to do here in the first round. Goes for the throw. Deftly shuts out the jumper. Backs them into the corner. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Player two with the life lead. Time to sit on the lead. Player big trouble here. The stun is going to leave them defenseless. Player one is going to have a hard time managing their drive now. Did this super arc connect? This is looking good. Opt for the throw to close it out. Player two picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Fantastic reactions there. Throws them. What's next? Scrapping it out up close. Misses the drive impact. Handle with care. You can't drop drive impacts. Player two is working with a better gauge. What can they do with it? What separates the good from the great in this game is smart gauge man. This is my chance. Player sets up with the jump in. Knocked out and... Not good enough. And he doesn't set the throw. Player two brings it home. Let's see if they can build themselves a streak. Our fighters are pumping themselves up and are raring to go. Who is going to come out on top in this fight? Got it. Round one. Fight. All right, first round. What's going to happen? Overdrive. Okay, we're in the early stages of the round. Both fighters have plenty of health. Where is this match going to go? Player two will be in a world of hurt if their drive gauge runs out. Still slugging it out here. The throw hits. Now the fun begins. Good work staying in throw range there. Player one chases them down. Hmm, taking stock. Player two needs to deal with this burnout. In a dire situation, they can't afford any mistakes. Had the late brings out the super art. Hmm, KO. Player one picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. Jump? Good job blocking the jump in. They're showing us just how patient they can be. Blocking a jump in attack means you're at a disadvantage, so they should be looking to anti air instead. Player one is in a pretty good situation with a meter advantage. What separates the good from the great in this game is smart gauge management. Player one will look to apply pressure here. Medium kick hits, barely blocks the jump in. Checks with a medium kick. Goes for the fireball, which is very hits him with a stopping bomb. Jinrai kick for a mix-up. Jumps up, connects with the throw. There's a wall splash. They can't do anything now. Amazing! Not much life left. There's a burnout. Player two, what a stun throw. The jump is... No, uh, no way, that win wasn't luck. That was 100% planned. Last round, people. Both fighters gotta go all in from this point. Tries to make something happen with an overdrive arc. Looking to follow up after that target combo. Risky up close scrap throws him. Impact squat. Uses the impact to shave off some of their drive gauge. Ooh, you never know what can happen here. Solid anti-air. A jump in? Ooh, what a smart throw. Pumps the brakes on the impact. What are they gonna do? Crowns them from above. 
Okay, here all the throws connects. Wipe drives and back misses. Noticeable life lead. Is a comeback still possible? They gotta go. Risky medium kick. Gotta hand it to both of our fighters. They put on a real clinic for us. It's not over yet. Best believe it's time for that run back. Attempts to break the stalemate with a fireball. Gets the combo. Anticipated that counter and blocked. Hmm, what are they thinking here? Uncomfortable space here. Can they clip each other on the edge? Player two can't let their drive gauge run out. They need to find a way to reset the situation. How much damage can they deal before the opponent's drive gauge replenishes? From up above, the quarter makes it hard to escape. What'll be the setup here? Life lead opens up. Player two in trouble with no drive. What'll happen? Team two Hadouken KO. Player two picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Overdrive Hadouken. Are we going to see some fireworks here? The jump in is denied. Player two chases them down. They gotta be careful not to overextend or their opponent might go for a side switch. Big throws. What'll happen here? They were expecting that drive impact. Excellent block to shut off the impact. Attempts to break the stalemate with the fireball. Going in. But there's a wall splash. They can't do it. Hey, oh! That's what happens when you capitalize on all of your chances. Challenger! And they've gone for the same character. Neither side's gonna want to lose this one. Let us be The fight's now underway. This is Vicious with the play by play. Difficult situation for a throw. Player two pushes the opponent into the corner. Takes a trip. They're jostling for the dominant position in the corner. What's their game plan here at this critical stage? Knockdown. Player one is almost dead, but some clutch drive moves and a few prayers could turn this around in their favor. Heading into the end game now, it's getting tense. K.O. Player two on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. Overdrive Hadouken. How will they take it? Ah, oh, burnout activates. The quarter makes it hard to escape. What'll be the set? Shinku Hadouken. Under pressure, but keeps cool and texting. Fires off the Shinku Hadouken. 
A quick breather. Ugh, just goes for it at this range. Snakes in the throw. Player two proved to be the victor in that mirror match. How is this rematch going to play out? Are we going to witness a blow up here? So, what are our fighters planning in this opening round? Gets the counter in. Impressive reactions there. Still slugging it out here. That drive impact is blocked. Player two has used up all of their drive gauge. Can they outlast it? Player two is in burnout. Drives off the table, reads their mind and texts the throw. Reads the throw and shuts it down. Strings it all together. Good job blocking the jump, charges forward. Overdrive Hadouken. Holds out with a block. Both can end the round now. Experiencing burnout. Going in, player one can't afford goals for the invincible special. They were confident that would hit. Player two takes the round like a thief in the night. What else can they get away with? Everything up until now, and everything from here on out, is so vital. Turns the drive gauge. He flies them open with a Shoryuken. So they break forward to pressure the opponent. Player one will want to take advantage of their meter lead while they have it. What separates the good from the great in this game is smart gauge management. Player two will need to play it conservative until their drive refreshes. Big opportunity now in this corner. Shows a medium kick. Drive gauge gap here. Jumps in, experiencing burnout. That's not gonna hit. Player one is in a pretty <laughs> perfect execution with the anti-air. Jumps up. Player two has depleted their drive gauge, but they are straight through with the throw. Player two showed they are truly the best of the best. How is this match going to shake out? It's going to be exciting to see. Round one. Fight. All right, first round. What's going to happen? Tries to turn up the pressure with an overdrive projectile. Player two pushes the opponent into the corner. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Player two is just about out of drive after that. Nails the timing and stings them. Throws them down. Was well in range to score the throw. Good job blocking the jump in. They're showing us just how patient they perfect parry to stop them. Time to go on the offensive. Player one needs to deal with this burnout. Heading into the end game now, it's getting tense. They decide to hang back and rethink their game plan. Does a good job of pushing back. Closing moments of the match. One uh, just goes for it at this range. Finishes with the throw. Player two on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. They've piled up the knowledge. Now, how are they going to use it? The jump in catches them. You can open up chances to do big damage by baiting something out, getting that opening, and then jumping in. Still scrapping for control of the space. Sai Hasho. Player two experiencing burnout. There's an overdrive shorty. Oh no, they're stunned. What were they thinking? Closing moments of the match. One hit, but it slams on the brakes and shuts out the counter. The drive gauge is doesn't set the throw. This is the final round. Expect to see some fireworks. Open with a jump in. Who will come out on top in this final round? 
Perfect execution with the anti-air. They just said, get that jump in, out of here. Player one needs to take advantage of this gauge to spin. Drop that off! Probably burning it right up with a super! Spend it all on the super! Not shy one bit about it! The super connects! They're taking a step back to slow down the pace. Jump! Ooh, what a smart throw! Pumps the brakes on the impact! Medium kick. Back is willing to risk it for the overdrive. Not looking good. The corner's a bad place to be. It, ooh, put a little F. No one could have called that. Player two is going to be watching replays for this one for a while. They really took it down to the wire. It's not over yet. Let's believe it's time for that comeback. A jump in? Jumps in. Oh, they're in the corner now. No running away. They've got nowhere to run now that they're in the corner. Lots of aggression from both sides. Throws them. What's next? Closes the gap for the grab. Fireball from very long. What's next here? Looks like they want to reestablish their game plan with fireballs. Gets the jump in. Holds out with the block. Did well to get the buff in there. So they break forward to pressure the opponent. Goes for the super arc. Burns a bar to unleash the storm. Sakai Fuhasan. They just went for it with that super. This may be the start of their counter offensive. Oh god, this is tense. The quarter makes it hard to escape. Experiencing burnout. Player two can't afford closes with the throw. Hitting them with the smart stuff. Round two. Player two picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Will this super arc connect? Goes for the suck by Fuhazan. Vintage jury. Player two did a great job of reading their opponent up close that last round. Can they keep the momentum? Their spacing is so on point right now. But who's going to blink first? Player two is in a pretty good situation with a meter advantage. A quick break. Ooh, what a smart throw. Impact squat. Player two is not blocks the low kick. A real, ah, uh, burnout activates. A jump in. What a finish. We're going into the final round tied up. Which fighter has it in them to grind out the win? Tries to make something happen with an overdrive arc. Ooh, does a dirty. Scrapping it out up close. Player one didn't rely too much on drive in that last round, but they may be looking to mix things up here. Pokes with a kick. Reads the jump in perfectly. D9! Keep cool and locks them out. Oh, here we go. No! Critical art now? Noticeable life lead. Is a comeback still possible? This is the path I have chosen. Danger tries to make something happen with an overdrive art. Are you serious? That comeback was unreal! We just saw the fighters play out of their goddamn mind there! Player two! Glitch is the win! But that could have been anyone's game. No way we could have called that. What are we going to see transpire between these fighters? No one knows, but this is going to be a must-see match. Let us begin. 
Here we go. What are these fighters going to do? Starts with a jump in. Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Can't take the throw. Mm, taking stock. Hits him for the stun. This might be over right here. With the life gap opening up, intercepts. Slick anti-air finish. Player one picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. They piled up the knowledge. Now, how are they going to use it? Was looking for that jump attack. Both fighters are looking for a way to get in, but there's still time to feel out the situation. Keeping track of the opponent's movements, waiting for a good opening. Rush that off and keeps going. Jump? Oh, what's this? They can't squander this punish counter. Thing. Player two, there's an overdrive for you. Still experiencing burnout. They're both distant leads to some big damage. The super doesn't hit. Reads the jump in perfectly. Attempts to break the stalemate with a fireball. This is gonna hurt. Flatline zone. Last round, people. Both fighters gotta go all in from this point. Open with a jump in? The last round. It's now or never. Hit them with a stopping bomb. Player two needs to use the threat of the corner here. Connects with the throw. Tries to act quickly, but whiffs the attack. Handle with care. You can't drop drive him back. Can this drive bring them back? Player one can't use throw them. Both sides. This can lead to some big damage. Noticeable life lead. Is a comeback still possible? Medium kick into pass them on the toe. There's a burnout. What are they going to do? Set the pit. It is over. I've seen a lot of fights in my day, but nothing even comes close to this one. It's not over yet. Best believe it's time for that run back. Drops him hard. Grounds him from above. Flashes him. Strings it all together. Somehow pushes back all the way to center stage. Gets out of the corner and creates some distance. Absorbs the attack and fires back. The jump in catches them. Gets the jump in. Knockdown. That's the jump in they were looking for. They're being absolutely relentless with this fireball pressure in the corner. Takes a trip. K.O. Player two on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. Sure you can. Goes for a projectile to try and change the pace. Holds out with the block. Goes for the jump in. Ooh, snap kick sends him spinning. At this range, many attacks can connect if you stick something out. The neutral game is very important. Hits him with a stop and pop. Backs them into the corner in a hurry. Ends the meter. Hoping for a good return. Are they dead off this super? It's too close to call. Perfect KO. They were in full control there. Well, listen. When you're locked in, you're locked in. That was a decisive win. Right back into the rematch. We ain't even close to done yet. Let's see what these fighters have up their sleeves out of the gate. Fantastic reaction there. They're on the lookout for jump-ins. Their drive gauge was running low, but they use an overdrive art anyway just to show they're not gun-shy. The cross-up connects. Player one can't let their drive gauge in. They need to find a way to reset the situation. Gets backed into the corner with pressure building. Very solid corner switch. Hey ho! Player one picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. Throws out a projectile. Connects with medium kick. Okay, they trade hits. Hit them with a stopping bomb. Gene right kick for a mix up. Ah, burnout activates. Somehow pushes back all the way to center stage. Player one will have to deal with this dangerous bout of burnout for a while. Both fighters planning something? Looking for a chance. Crowns them from above. Noticeable luck sees the overhead coming. 